Welcome to another edition of PDS Tips, the how-to edition. Today we will be going over the Xerox Device Agent, or XDA. We will also cover the Fleet Management Portal, or FMP. The XDA is an app that is installed on either a network server or your Windows desktop. It is the link between your printing device and our service and ordering tool, also known as Fleet Management Portal. With FNP, you now have the control to order supplies, request for service, and view device status metrics as well as device reports. Now let's get into how to use FNP. From our desktop, we'll head to the internet browser and in the URL address bar, we will type in pds-co.com forward slash FMP. Once at the FMP website, you'll have your customer login. This is where you're going to type in your username and password. I have mine saved. Just click on that. If you do not have a password, please follow the forget password prompts and it will be emailed to you. Let's log in. This is your dashboard of all your printing fleets. Down here you can view all your printers. You can request for service and view past service requests as well as order supplies and view supply orders. Let's go ahead and take a look at our printers. This is where you will be able to view all your printing fleet. Now to order for toner, let's click on a device. This will tell you the device model, serial number, and location. It will also represent the toner usage and how much is left by percentage. Over on the left here, we can see order supplies. On this page, it will show you the different supplies and consumables you can order for this device. Under quantity, you can place up to two depending on what is on your shelf. For this device, I'd like to order one black toner. On the right, you can see add to shopping cart. On this page, we can review our order, and if ready to check out, we can go to check out. On the checkout page, you'll see the shipping address, email, phone number, also the totals, and who is ordered by. Once this is all complete, we can move to submit order. Once you've submit your order, a confirmation order number will pop up. Please keep that for all your records. And now we have completed ordering supplies. 